Hi Aquarius, <clears throat> excuse me, hi Aquarius, this is your weekly reading, thank you for being here, my name is L. let's go ahead and get into this Aquarius, um, thank you God for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you this week, alright, let's see what's going on this week, what is the energy for the week for the Aquarius, I just saw the Ace of Pentacles pop out, so there could be a windfall, a large sum of money. Some of you are just really working out, getting better immunity, health. You've seen some manifestation of a, a dream, a wish come true. you actually seeing that you can do something, self-actualization. Your mental capacity, your psychological capacity is on high. So you understand your true potential, what you really can do. Wow, can't make this up. I've been shuffling since I've been talking. Ace of Pentacles, all of that, everything I was just saying. It might be an opportunity for you to meet somebody, uh, new or old, and it looks like it'll go to maybe like sex really fast. Whatever, you know, I don't know. Um, let's see what else is going on. You could be starting a garden or trying to get into horticulture. Let's see what else is going on for the Aquarius. What's the advice for Aquarius this week? advice for Aquarius this week wow the nine of pentacles very nice Aquarius you're ready okay just heard you're ready uh, you are a walking garden you have everything more than most you are abundant if you don't feel that way do know that you are people look at you in that in that way you could be a business owner a savvy business owner you make things happen you get creative in terms of your business um you could be solo in your business too. You could be the business owner and the worker and the employee and the help, you know. So you don't have um, employees just yet. You are the employee. Um, there also could be you, Aquarius. I don't know if you're, you're really open to an intimate connection, intimate relationship here. You could be kind of closed down to that because it talks about lack of intimacy here. Keeping relationships outside of your home or your heart space you just don't want it there right now for whatever reason um it also talks about wow aquarius um okay i, I was gonna try to put it back but i'm gonna leave it here um the nine of pentacles talks about now you're at a place aquarius where what you have done in the past in in the eight of pentacles that wash rinse repeat cycle it, it's bringing you to the nine of pentacles therefore your stability your financial prosperity is solidified in the work that you've already done. So you don't need to work that hard. Also, you can now engage in explore spirituality because now it says spirituality is complete in financial abundance or financial stability. So when you're working too much, and you're worried about money and you have to do something over and over again. And you you're you're counting your money, your dollars, your cents. You can't be worried about anything but money, okay? Because that is the exchange of this life, okay? If you don't have it, then you can't exchange anything. You can't exchange the gas in your car or the gas for your home or the electric for your home if you don't have money. But now it says you're the nine of pentacles. You're not doing so much work, labor. It's not laborious for you. Therefore, you can start to explore so many other things things so many higher things higher learning education uh, for some of you expect a message or a package in the mail here these cards wanted to flip out king of pentacles aquarius i don't know what you're doing but keep at it aquarius um <laughs> wow you go from the nine of pentacles to the king of pentacles you know your money is working for you your, your money is working for you overnight you know, they say uh, there's a book. I forget the name of the book. I read it. You know, when you have made it or your business is working for you or this is what you should be doing when you can make money in your sleep. So Aquarius, the king of pentacles is the king who makes money in his sleep. His, his money works for him. He's not working for his money. Remember, the queens are the doers of the tarot. So um, the king of pentacles has already solidified that work. And that wash, rinse, repeat, he, has, he or she doesn't have to do that anymore. It says that a very methodical, logical, rational person could come into your life, offer you a lot of advice, a lot of good advice. They may not be very romantic, but they're a very good businesswoman or man. 
they have a lot of uh, knowledge in terms of business, in terms of money making, uh, uh, sustainability. It says that you're going to be financially stable by your own doing, by your own hand. Okay. Uh, this is not somebody who got a hand out. You've got the King of Cups and the Eight of Cups. You may have to made, you may have made a tough decision to walk away from something or somebody who wasn't. Um, they didn't want what you wanted. You both are coming up in masculine energy, so you, you, you're definitely at odds here. There is a discord between the two of you. You don't see kingdoms or kings coming together and really being, you know, exactly cordial. No, they have something, you know, there's discord there. You know, you've got a kingdom, I've got a kingdom. There's not a lot of, no, neither one is going to concede to the other. So maybe in a relationship that you have been in, Aquarius, or you were in, or you are in, there's no concession made. There's no compassion. There's no openness. There's no intimacy. You come off as very masculine. It may be warranted. It may not be. You know your life. I don't. But you've got two kings showing up here. For some of you, it could just be same sex. But you may have not always been as masculine in the, in the connection, especially in the beginning. But maybe there, there's a shift in the energy where you feel like you had to protect yourself. And we know masculine energy is about protection. So you felt like you had to protect yourself from maybe this other king. Um, the king of cups is um, the king of emotions. You couldn't read this person. You thought that you could. You thought that there, there was common ground or you could level with this person, but you could not. You both were on two different planes here. It looks like somebody is in their emotions now and you're in your pentacle. You're in your bag, if you will. You, you're in things that you can't control. You can control how much money, how much influence, how much power, how much prestige uh, you can have. So that's where you are. And it looks like somebody else is in their emotions. Regret, resentment, remorse. Maybe for walking away from you, turning their back on you you know, becoming very despondent in a relationship. Also, there could be a bit of spying. Let's see what's going on here in terms of the Kipper. Um, we're going to pull a, a fortune telling deck. There's some spying. Both of you coming at the relationship very cerebral, very mental. Like, I got to think about what I got to say first, and I got to be the first one to, you know, uh, clap back, snap back. And yeah, let me tell this person. But it's like, there's a reframing from talking to one another because there could, it could just be argument also. Somebody needs to be more emotion, not emotional, but mentally mature. Someone also needs to be more tactful in their communication. You can't say everything that you think about, but you need to learn how to word it. What is this about for the Aquarius? What can we say for the Aquarius? It's a gift coming out, gift from the universe. Wow, Aquarius, the privileged lady sits on the nine of pentacles. Aquarius, you said, you know what? I'm just going to worry about stuff that I can't worry about. Stuff that I can control. I can control my occupation. Some of you do, you know, um, independent work. You have your own business. Um, you got busy with your occupation. You are occupied with what you do for a living, what you do to bring in income. You no longer, like I said, somebody's in their feelings. You're in, in a place of let me engage in what I can't control because I can't control other people, relationships and emotions. Therefore I'll engage in what I can control. This is what I have for you. Aquarius really interesting week. You got money coming in, money, just flowing money, money, money. You are money. You are walking garden Aquarius. Um, if you feel like this reading resonates for you, drop down in the comment section and put a money sign in the, in the comment section. Just put money all, I want money all over the comment section so that all the Aquarius can feel the vibration of money, especially if you are in a place of lack. Um, let, let this be inspiration for you. 
we're not about materialism, but we are about living well and thriving. So if you are one of those people who come over here and say money is and everything, stay where you are because we know that we can't take that to the bank. We cannot go to the bank and tell the bank money is not everything. You can do that, but we can't. So anyhow, all my Aquarius, drop down in the comment section. I want to see all the money signs, the money emojis, the bags, everything, okay? Because um, this is this is your time, Aquarius. So um, also go over to the website, book your own reading there. If you feel like you want to drill down on your energy, ask some questions to the tarot cards. You can book your own reading. You can ask a question via the text. Text your question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel. If you took something from the reading, let the exchange happen. Um, you could donate to the channel. Buy me a coffee. Thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.